Hi guys and welcome to a vlog today. First of all, I just want to say thank you so much, like a huge thank you. Last night I put up the sale items for my studio sale, which is in my last video if you've not seen it. And oh my goodness, like I thought maybe I might sell a couple of paintings, two or three. I got 20 orders last night and I sold 21 paintings, like that has just blown my mind. I can't actually get my head around it. So I just want to say a huge thank you. So I thought it'd be really cool to show you guys the packaging process today and show you wrapping all your lovely orders. I'm going to be doing some videos soon as well, all about selling on Etsy, how to sell your art, packaging artwork, pricing artwork, all the sorts of things that you need to know before you start selling your artwork. So, if you guys have any questions about any of that, let me know in the comments and I'll try my best to include the answers to all your questions in the videos. So yeah, if you have any questions, leave them in the comments section and I will try and make sure they get answered. So what I'm going to do is make a cup of tea. I have already packaged a few orders, not many, um, but I've got a lot to get through. So I'm going to be a packaging machine today. <laughs> but um, I've got my cup of tea and the next one to package is this watercolour rose painting so I'm gonna go ahead and package that up now so I don't know if you guys are anything like me when I order something online unwrapping it and looking at the packaging is all part of the experience so I really tried to bear that in mind when I'm wrapping these orders for you guys because I really want it to be exciting when you get the package in the mail and you can sit down and open it. I just, I want that whole process to be really enjoyable. But obviously also I want your artwork to arrive in perfect condition. So it can be a difficult balance getting both of those two things right. But I feel like I found a really good way of doing that now. There are a few little bits that I have got custom made with my branding on. So I've got little thank you for your order, uh, note cards, and also I've had stickers made with my paintings on. I get a lot of questions where I get these from, um, but I've tried loads of different places. Many different places do them, and it's just a case of finding which one's right for you and with the right price. So the first thing that I do is wrap up my orders with acid free tissue paper. With my watercolour pieces or acrylic pieces that are on paper, I also like to add a little bit of foam board in with that which just keeps it rigid and makes sure the artwork doesn't get bent. Foam board, if you're not familiar with it, is kind of like a polystyrene with a cardboard backing which is great because it means it's really light for shipping but it is also going to add that extra bit of firmness to make sure that it doesn't get damaged in the mail. Then I wrap this all up with acid free tissue paper which really protects the painting and it adds a nice sheen to it. And I do also like to add a little bit of cord around my paintings. I feel like it finishes it off really nice and makes it almost look like a little gift. And then with those orders, I put in one of my business cards and a little personalized thank you note to thank you for your order. I really like to use please do not bend envelopes which also have the cardboard backing to them again just for extra protection and something really important is the fragile tape I feel like that draws attention to anybody handling the order that it needs extra care so it is such a beautiful beautiful day we've had quite a few really gorgeous days and the sun is out and it's just 
It's lovely. I'll show you guys the view. Okay, so I've wrapped one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. <laughs> I've wrapped eight orders. Eight orders out of 20. Uh, I think it's maybe time for some lunch because I've been doing this for maybe a couple of hours now. So yeah, it does take a long time to wrap orders, but I really wanna make sure that each one is wrapped with love and gratitude. So I'm going to pop these to the side for now, go and get some lunch and then carry on wrapping later. But most of all, I just want to say a massive thank you again to all your amazing support, whether that's through buying paintings and orders or whether that's just a view on YouTube, a like, a subscribe, a comment. All these things mean so much to me and it really spurs me on to carry on. Spurs me on to carry on. Yeah, you know what I mean. Anyway, thank you so much guys and have a wonderful week. Bye.